Okay, the rest of here, here I am again. This next one is a prayer journal that I made. Um, I printed this off the internet somewhere and it even had this on it. Um, and I actually just cut it up into strips and decoupaged it to the front. That's why it has that little gloss. So I tried to make the, it's a prayer journal. I tried to make the top look like a crown, which is why I have the bling. And look at the back, I love it. His love endures forever. This is decoupage napkin as the base coat. And everything's like decoupage. I just had this in my stash and I blinged it up. On the darkest days when I feel inadequate, unloved, and unworthy, I remember whose daughter I am and I straighten my crown. So I love the layering on it, the crown. And so I just tried to make it look like a crown. I love it. I think it's so cute. I'm into the dangles off the edges over here seam binding closure again it's another tiny one not that tiny but it's a it's good a good writing journal good for writing um prayers and scriptures and stuff like that so there's the yumminess on the side not not too much on the top four signatures this one has um 120 pages a little bit smaller it's five but it's by three and a half it's a little bit smaller and then my same inspiration thank you ladies all right and then so I'm gonna go inside so I have the this book belongs to and then I stamped this and had those um some kind of pen that you have to um dry it with a heat gun and it says pray I want to just say prayer journal but it says pray <laughs> and then I, these little pages is from a little little tiny prayer journal so you can read those write about them there's the little paper clip dangles everything's coffee stained even if it's white i put it through water and i oven baked it and oh these are from um what's that ladies um dreams etc and then there's that that I saw, like Angie Bunner using it. But of course, it's, hers is like super stitched up. And, but I like it. It's cute. It's a cute image. And then I made my own little tag out of graph paper. And the scripture on it. I mean, uh, like that. Flip up. I always get these inspired by Yvonne Preston. And we always all go shut. <laughs> but it's open. It's open now. These are from Tsunami Rose. And I inserted them throughout. And altered clips throughout. With uh, Sorry Silk. And of course when you're doing a video. You don't have that much time left. And these actually have acetate behind them. They're the extra cut, but I made them into a pocket. I can do all things through Christ who strengthens me. The tsunami rose inscribed on the palm of your hand. These came from your Timbers Ventures Garden, that butterfly stack, this, these pockets. It's just the paper, but I figure you can journal on the envelope too. So it's one in each signature and with a tsunami rose prayer. One of those little ruffles. Uh, sorry. Something got in my eye. Okay. Oh, that's not a flip up. That was a little mason jar. I don't know why, but I got out my washi tape for a change. I think this is a Tim Holtz. I just had it. I liked it. Make the good tab. Praise the Lord. And there's my little tabs. Um, with the graph paper and stuff inside. Just nothing, a couple of little vintage tickets. All the insides have the tsunami rolls, little, um, like prayer cards, journaling cards, coffee dyes. Got the little scripture. 
strings, etc. And again, I made another one of these envelopes with the pretty journaling card sticking through the envelope. And I had to redo it after I coffee dyed it. You have to put your own acetate in there. I do because acetate shrivels up after I bake it. Little bag. It's a tsunami rose tag in there. Or journaling card. Just another little baby tag. God's grace. A little time card inside. And I don't know if I stitched these. I don't think I did. Maybe. I don't know. I can't really see it. Be surprised. Whoever wants this one. This one's also going to be the same. It's the same. 40 ship including everything i will ship it for 40 dollars. that includes all fees for paypal invoice and everything that's beautiful i just put it all includes inclusive tsunami rose there's another one of those envelopes and it's butterfly kisses and i just used the whole piece of paper as an envelope so you can journal on that these are the things I think of because I like to journal. And I like to write on envelopes and stuff. God is love. Yes, I don't know where. It was just in my stash. It's a paper, um, such texture. Paper, um, ruffle. I love the texture of it and the feel of that book. Tsunami Rose, I think, I guess. She's where I get most of my ephemera from. Here's the back of that envelope. And it says Faith. Here's another one because this is so chunky. Here's another my acetate little butterfly. And I just put acetate behind it. But it's just an extra cut, just an off cut. That I stamp my butterfly, I punch my butterflies out of. Tangy pocket. Trust in the Lord. It's like a ticket. And I can get this little baby out. There she is. Little mason jar that I can write on or you can write on. There's the tsunami rose. Here is the little dangle charm that's a cross on a garment pin. The big pocket, and these pockets are all stitched too. Uh, you can't really see it, you have to have the journal in your hand. There's another time card you can write on. And I just saved that. It says stained tags. I use it as my tab. Rejoice in the Lord. You can open it up for extended journaling. Here's a flip up. And the tsunami rose. Praise the Lord. Piece of coffee stain that I made into a flip up so you can write on it. You can also read that or write on top of it, but it's real, it's scripture. It's not from a Bible or anything, but it's kind of just some kind of a, um, come from a prayer journal that you can read. And it has some good little stories on how the scripture helped them through a tough time. Grandma's ephemera. In case you're in bad health, it tells you how to handle it. This I'm not going to open, but you have to untie it and get the little journaling card. That can be a secret prayer, maybe a prayer um, prayer list for the sick and shut in. That's just a coffee stain, but I did the um, die cut of it. I'm not going to open that. You can do something secret. It just has some extra paper in there or a journaling card. Come to me, you win. Like that. 
That's the top pocket. Got with this. There's another big pocket with probably some extra. Yep. I love how the coffee came out of it. And these these are actually just cream colored. If they're cream colored, I really didn't coffee stain them. They are just ran through water and baked so they can have be crispy. Little tag. Wow, I didn't put lines on that one. This is my absolute favorite. All creatures great and small, the Lord God made them all. It's stitched to the book page. And it's like some little stickers, but I made them kind of like a shaker. But I'm, it's not going to be a shaker. You can just see each of the animals. Now, I don't know what that small animal is, but there's a squirrel and a rabbit. That is so adorable for me. I love that. But you can't do anything under. It's like a decorative page. You would have to write on the back and on this tag. That's my absolute favorite. And then this is just made out of a tag. You can extra write in it. Believe with the altered tag of the heart. Here's another top loader. And that's it. Back is plain because I think it's busy enough. It has enough going on. It is so cute. So again, 40 shipped at my PayPal. If you were interested, just um, PM me that you would like it. Leave me your email address and I'll send you an invoice. This one is also still up for sale too, but this one is in my Etsy shop. But if you want it, you can let me know and I can put it through my PayPal. This one is $25 shipped with everything, including the invoice and shipping and handling. All right, so that's my shares for today. Um, see you next time. Bye-bye.